This is my friend's Celestron eyepiece and filter accessory kit. It's a 14 piece kit. It comes in this great, really sturdy case. When she opens it up, you can see there's really nice firm foam in there. So just so you're aware, these two lenses in the slot on the left do not come with the kit. They came with her Celestron telescope. But all these others are part of the kit. And we're looking here at the different apertures. Here, I think, is the... What does it say here on the side? I'm just checking them out. Look how pretty. That might be the 8 millimeter. Or no, 13 millimeter right there. And here she's showing me some of the other sizes and explaining how the different apertures essentially are like a different uh, power of lens. This one here is called a Barlow lens and is the reason they chose this kit over other kits is that they liked that it included this. So this lens, you can pop another lens into it and it essentially doubles the strength or magnification of that lens. So by having the Barlow lens in here, you essentially have double the lenses that you did before. So here you can see it fits right into the eyepiece with the Barlow lens. You can also take the Barlow lens out and just put the eyepiece in by itself. So these are one and a quarter inch lenses in case you were wondering. So these can fit in any telescope that's made for one and a quarter inch lenses. Overall, these lenses seem really well made, really beautiful. This one here, you can see how wide open the glass is compared to the other one. So this big wide open one, you would not want to look at the moon, for example, because you'd be blinded. But the littler one would be perfect for looking at the moon. Now my friend is showing me all the different colored light filters. So these will show and emphasize different colors of light. Uh, there's a moon specific one in here and then there's just a whole bunch of other colors. So it's really cool to see with this kit you just get quite the range of tools to look at all kinds of different things in the night sky. So I recommend this to anyone who's wanting to expand their astronomy abilities.